Hi, welcome to a video tutorial from Equator. My name is Ahmed Shamshiri. In this video, we are going to use this Casio FX991 EF Plus second edition scientific calculator to solve system of equations with two and three variables with this calculator. Let's get started with this. When we have two variables of x and y, then we must have two equations. Here is an example. We have 2x plus 4y equals 10, and we have x minus 6y equals minus 3. As you can see, we have one equation and two equations, and we have two variables, x and y. If we have three variables, if we have three variables, we need three equations. In this case, let's see how we can solve it. Now let's see how we can do it. Press mode, and then go number 5, equation EQN, and here, it, because we are using two variables, we press 1. And here on this screen, we have been presented with this uh, field of matrix that we can enter the value. 1 is referring to equation 1, 2 refers to equation 2. A, B, and C are the coefficients. So here, A1 is this 2 coefficient of x. So we enter here A and then 1. So we enter 2 and I, I enter 2 and press equal. As soon as you press equal, the 2 will move here for the B. And this is now B1, 4, B, and then 1. Because we are in row 1, this is all equation 1. So for the B, we enter 4 and then press equal. And it moves to the C. And C1 is 10. I'm pressing 10 and press equal. As soon as I press equal sign, it moves here. And as you can see, 2, 4, and 10, which I have highlighted here, are entered. For A2, so we enter 1 and then equal, it goes to the B, which is 6, and then press equal, and then minus 3 for the C2, C2. So we enter this minus and then 3 and press equal. Once everything is completed, press finally the, uh, the equal sign and it shows X is equal 9. So if we enter x equal 9, this equation will be true. And then if you press it again, it shows y as minus 2. Now let's see how we can do three equations. If to solve three equations, we must have three variables, x, y, and z. Now press mode and go to equation number 5. And this time press 2 because we have x, y, and z. Now we have been presented the same as before, but we have extra line for equation. And here, if we have this equation, x plus 5y plus z equals 15, and 3x plus y plus 6z equals 20. And in this one, minus 2x minus y plus 8y is equal 8. So in this case, a1 is 1, I'm pressing 1. A1 is entered, equal sign, and then B1 is 5, equal, C1 is 1, because the coefficient of Z is 1, press equal, and it moves to the D, because we were not able to see it, 15, and then press equal, then it moves back here, 3 for A2, A, and then 2, and then B2 is 1, B2, I'm pressing 1, and it moves to C2, C2 is 6, and as you can see, and then D2, for the equation D2 is 20, and then press equal, it moves now in equation number 3 for A, so A3 is minus 2, I'm pressing this minus and 2 equal, and B3 is 8, equal, and here C3, because we have no variable, it is 0, we must enter here 0, and then D3 is 8. Now all the coefficients have been entered here, just press equal, X is equal 4, press it again, Y is equal 2, and press it again, Z is equal 1. If I press it again, I will be presented back with this screen to enter new values if you have another equation. 
To exit from this screen, press mode and then 1. To access all my other videos related for this calculator, please check the link below the video in the description. Thank you for watching. This was how to use this Casio FX911 ES Plus second edition scientific calculator. If you learned something and found this useful, please thumb up as this will help my video in the search algorithm of YouTube. If you have comment or question, please post it at the comment section below. I try to answer and reply. And don't forget to subscribe so you get updates of my upcoming videos. or press all clear recall x and we got the exact value if you want to 1500 and the answer is 7 over 3 and that's this is our integration and the area under the curve shows like this so from 1 to 2 and as you can see the answer is 2.333 Two three zero two equal three equal zero equal and then it goes to the next one.